the unboxing of the lightning to USB camera adapter. So this is what it looks like. Normal stuff, warranty, user guide, and here's the bad boy. Here's the bad boy. Oh, it's quite small, not as big. So the reason for this is, okay, this is the reason. So you need to plug a power in, USB goes in, which is connected to the hard drive which is not spinning at the moment and then you plug it in to your phone or iPad I think it's turning on then you go to then you go to files like so my drive browse and you would hope to see a hard drive but we cannot see a hard drive so why is that Oh, uh huh. It didn't work, guys. It didn't bloody work. Back again, so I've been Googling this uh, camera adapter, trying to get a hard drive to work. And, and normal hard drives like this don't work when you connect it to this adapter. It wasn't having it. I Googled it. I Googled it. People were saying it's working, not a problem. All good, but it doesn't work. So be careful. If you do buy this adapter, it will not work with a normal hard drive. But if you do have an SSD solid state hard drive, which I've got here and put it into a container with a USB type C and the other end is a USB, then you plug that into the bottom of your phone, go to files, give it a second and then you'll be able to see the 250 gig SSD. So that was where it works now. So I have to use it this way to back up my stuff and then transfer it to this hard drive, which is a bit long winded, but at least I've got a working solution. So remember, normal hard drive, so this is from Western Digital, doesn't pick up, but a solid state drive is working. So, yeah, just be careful what you do and you need to make sure that you have this adapter so you can power the solid state SSD. If you have any questions, put it in below. Uh, please subscribe to my random channel uh, because I need people. Thank you, please. Peace.